The Montgomery College Raptors men's soccer team earned the number one seed entering the NJCAA D1 Region 20 soccer tournament, which is pretty amazing considering this is the team's first season as a D1 program. And in their semifinal match, the Raptors faced the CCBC Catonsville Cardinals, the four seed and a team MC had beaten 4-2 back in early September. And the Raptors wasted little time getting on the board in the fourth minute after a throw-in near the Catonsville goal, MC's Kenny Fuentes controlled the ball and sent a beauty to the doorstep where he found Bobby Riffle who beat three defenders to send it into the left corner and quickly put MC up 1-0, just 3-24 into the match. Then, just five minutes later in the ninth minute, Fuentes has free reign down the sideline. He hits Edwin Ramirez who finds Daniel Jurecic who puts it right on the boot of Yunus Ben Muna and he does the rest, burying it into the far corner and just like that, the Raptors were up 2-0, just 9.39 in. And despite an injury to starting keeper Christian Andrade, who made a gutsy stop on a Catonsville breakaway, the Raptors took the two-goal lead into the break. An update on Andrade's condition showed a pretty serious cut on his face, but he should be fine soon. Both defenses dominated play in the second half, but about 25 minutes in, MC's Ramirez with the steal. He sends a beauty to Ben Muna, who runs it down, beats the defense, but his on-target shot is stopped. Then, just three minutes later, Catonsville with their best chance to this point, but MC keeper Parker Sugars is there to stop the shot and keep the Cardinals off the board. Then, in the 85th minute, Nanyulugo Anya sends a pretty ball through the defense. Ben Muna runs it down, he's all alone, draws the keeper out, but then hits Alex Villatoro, who sends it home, and it's 3-0 Raptors with just 10 minutes to play. Catonsville did get on the board in the 88th minute after Max Munther Anderson headed in a beautiful kick from Jonathan Reyes, but it was too little too late as the Raptors took it 3-1. The win puts the Raptors in the regional finals on Saturday at 1.30 p.m against CCBC Essex, who beat Frederick on PKs in the other semi. And if they take that one, it's on to the D1 Nationals for the MC Raptors. For the Raptor Report, I'm Michael Brown.